Welcome back to STL Live. I'm Erica Parr. Here with me is Mark Gordon of the Chamber Music Society of St. Louis. And you're telling me about your upcoming concert, Around the World in 80 Minutes. We modeled this concert after one that we did a few years ago called Musical Tapas. Mm -hmm. I love that. Combine music and food, <laughs> you got a winner. Exactly. And, and the theme in this program is we had composers representing a number of different countries. So mm -hmm. we have a, a work by Haydn that represents Austria, a work by Puccini for Italy, Grieg for Norway, and, and so on. So it's, I think part of what our plan has been is to introduce our audiences to a lot of different sounds within that 70 to 80 minute program. Mm -hmm. And we are very relaxed, as I mentioned, the cabaret style. What, can you, what do you have to wear? Is there a dress code? No, there is not. It's, uh, we have people coming in everything from tennis shoes. Some people will wear a coat and tie if they're comfortable in that, but mm -hmm. it, it uh, runs the gamut. And I love that because sometimes orchestra or chamber music can be intimidating. Well, that's a, that's a really good point, Erica, because that was part of what went into our design of how we do our programs in this cabaret style. There is a perceived wall of formality about classical music, mm -hmm. and it's really perceived. It's not necessarily... Accurate or true. Yeah, it doesn't need to, and it certainly isn't with ours. Actually, we don't have program notes. I'll stand up and talk to the audience about, we don't talk about dates, but we'll talk about the music and little stories about the composers or the performers who made the first uh, performance of a certain piece and we inject it with humor and sometimes include the audience so it's it's very relaxed and uh, again the big word we emphasize is fun it should be fun I think so because in that way anybody can come they don't have to feel like there's a pretense to show up to listen to this love this lovely lovely music so tell me one of the stories you might tell the audience about one of the composers for your upcoming concert well we had one uh, work that was a, uh, a work by Schumann and Schumann, Robert Schumann and his wife Clara Schumann were very important musical figures. And he wrote a work that included strings and piano. And Clara Schumann was an excellent pianist and also a composer in her own right. Mm -hmm. And she got sick between the rehearsal and the concert. And so they had to call in somebody to do the piano part without any rehearsal. Mm. And it turned out to be a pianist named Felix Mendelssohn. <laughs> and the audience just went nuts. They just right. loved it. So those kinds of things help an audience connect with the music. Mm -hmm. And they're not going to go home and remember if I say what date the piece was written in. Right. But it's, and there's all kinds of funny stories that are connected with it. And that's, that's, it's entertaining. I love that. Why do you love music so much? Oh, boy, I don't, I don't know how. I actually came to music kind of late. My parents forced me to take piano lessons when I oh was 10 gosh. years old. Right, my mom too. I wanted to be out playing baseball <laughs> and I finally talked them into letting me quit. Then a few years lapsed, I went to high school and my mother said, well, you're gonna have to take music. So she talked me into taking up an instrument. Mm -hmm. And two years and I was, I was done. You were hooked. <laughs> I was hooked. <laughs> and so many years later, here you are just sharing the music that you've learned with the, with the world, especially here in St. Louis. It is a passion and we are so lucky in St. Louis because we have this one of the world's great orchestras. We have a collection of incredible musicians that could work anywhere in the world. Mm -hmm. so. And it's and it's attainable. You know, it's right in Grand Center. It's very informal. It's around the world in 80 minutes. What are the dates again? March 14th and 15th, Monday and Tuesday evening. Same program, both nights. Okay, and the website if people want to get more information? www.chambermusicstl.org. I love that. Thank you so much. My pleasure to be here. And send my regards to your wife. Maybe Thank next you. time she can come. I will bring her. <laughs> <laughs> excellent, excellent. For more details about Around the World in 80 Minutes or the Chamber Music Society of St. Louis, visit chambermusicstl.org. There's more STL Live right after this. Stay with us. <laughs>